Okay, greetings one and all, and welcome to this has to be day number two, week 13, fall 2024 of our journey together. And it's definitely a delight to have each and every one of you here for this evening's classes or this afternoon's classes. Um, let's begin. Um, um, my name is Mr. Petit. Um, my name, today is Tuesday, right? Tuesday, Tuesday the 26th of November, 2024. The subject is of course, um, mathematics. Yesterday we did area of a rectangle word problems. Today we're gonna be looking at another word problem but we're looking at the area of a triangle. Now, remember every time we're doing area, we have to put it in the unit squared. Um, and so just bear that in mind. So that means that for this one, the topic is um, area of triangle, triangle, word problems, word problems. So make sure you have your ruler and your pencil because we're going to be um, drawing. Excuse me, can I get my ruler please? Yes, you can. Um, Herman, please put that away. You don't need that blue light. You don't need the blue light. Can I get my ruler please? Yes, you can. Wait, um, You got it? Excuse me, Mr. Petit. Go ahead. Yes, sir, I have one. May I get my ruler? Yes, you can. All right, so I want us to draw a triangle, but it's a specific type of triangle that I want us to draw. We call this, anyone know what the type of triangle this is? This one. It's a, there's a specific name for this one. Does it start with an E? E, that's equilateral, no. A specific name for this one. Um, anyone know? I'm going to share with you right now. So there's something else we need to put on this. We need to put, um, let me, we need to put, so draw the triangle just like this, okay? Um, we are going to say that our triangle, there's like a, there's like a box here, like a, a little box here. Um, uh, and there's like 12 millimeters, right? So it's 12 millimeters. And then here we have at the bottom, we have a nine millimeters, nine millimeters. Can I get some of my Bible quick? Yes, you can. So we have 12 millimeters, nine millimeters. And then here we have six millimeters. So we have six millimeters. Um, so the first question is part A, part number one A, is we want to find the area, find the area of the triangle. Um, uh, 
find the area of the triangle. Um, that's the first thing we're gonna do. So area of the triangle. So I'm gonna give you the formula first. So we wanna find the area of the triangle. Oh, by the way, we're gonna call this one. We're gonna say that this part is, we're gonna say that this part is, this part is X. So we wanna figure out what X is. All right, so that's what we want to figure And so our goal is to find the area of the triangle. Um, so in order for us to find the area of a triangle, by the way, do you all have this drawn? Do you all have the triangle drawn? Let me know if you all have this drawn, please. Yes, yeah, so. sir. Yes, sir. Okay, so we have to find the area of um, the triangle. So write this down, please. We have to figure out what the area of the triangle is. Now, area of a triangle in general is going to be equal to the base of the triangle, base of the triangle multiplied by. You want to the area of the triangle? Mm -hmm. Yes, multiplied by the height. Of the triangle so area of the triangle is equal to base times height divided by all divided by divided by two so base times height divided by two now, that's the formula for the area of a triangle. And so Herman, what is the formula for the area of a triangle? Herman, what's the formula for the area of a triangle? Base times height two. Divided by two. Divided, divided by, by two. two, okay. Wynette, what's the formula for the area of a triangle? What's the formula for the area of a triangle? Oh, base times height. Divided by two. Divided by two. Yes. And Caden, what's the formula for the area of a triangle? Base, base times height divided by two. Divided by two. Now the bar or this line means division. All right. This line means division, okay? Legacy was the formula for the area of a triangle. Base times height divided by two. Is that Trinity? No, yeah. sir. Is Trinity here? Yes, sir. Oh, I thought I saw her. Yes, Trinity, what's the formula for the area of a triangle? Um. Say it again. Say it again. I get belly at you. Base times height. All right. Divided by two. All right. So say that for me. Base times height divided by two. Very good. Base times height divided by two. Now, what is the base? All right. Herman, turn on your camera. What is the base? What is the base? Is it nine millimeters? The base. The base is going to be the one at the bottom. So this right here is the base. All right. It's the base. So what is the base in terms of meters? Millimeters is what? 
Nine millimeters, right? Nine millimeters. And what is the height? Six, six millimeters. The height is six. Very good. The height is six. Now, 12 is what we call the hypotenuse. 12 millimeters is the hypotenuse. What do we know about how is 12 different from the other lengths? How is 12 different from the other lengths? It's, 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 it's longer. It's the longest. It's the longest. So what that means is the hypotenuse is always the longest side, right? We don't ever use the hypotenuse when we're um when we are uh, using our formula for a river triangle. We only use the base and the height, all right? And so we have base, which is nine, and height, which is six. And so let's do that. So it's gonna be a river triangle, it's gonna be equal to, gonna be equal to, what is the base? Mm -hmm. Do we always divide it by two in every case? That's a good question. We always divide it by two, right? Always, and that's the formula. Base times height divided by two. And so we have the base, which is nine millimeters. Nine millimeters multiplied by the height, which is what? What's the height? Six millimeters. Six, Six millimeters. millimeters. Six millimeters. Very good. And then we're going to divide it by what? Divided by two. Divided by two. two. Good. And so it's going to be equal to what is nine times six? 54. Nine times six is? 54. 54. Right, 54. 54 millimeters what? Squared. 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 Yes, squared. Millimeters squared. Because millimeters wow. times millimeters is millimeters squared. Divided by what? Two. Divided by two. And what is 54 divided by two? 27. 27. Already already divided that? So 54 divided by two. So we have two into two into, how many times can two go into 54? Um, two goes into five, how many times? Two times, two times two is four. I got my answer, Mr. Petit. What you got? Five minus four 22. is one. Uh, we bring down the four. How many times does two go into 14? Seven times. Seven times. Two times seven is 14. 14. 14, very good. We have 14 minus 14, which is going to be what? Zero. Zero, very good. And so we have 54 millimeters squared divided by two, and that gives us what? That gives us what? 27, what? 27 millimeters, millimeters what? Squared. 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 And that's how we find the area of the triangle. So go ahead, Wynette, explain how we got the area of the triangle, please. So we got the area of the nine milliliters times six milliliters, which equal to, oh, divided by two oh. is equals to 54 milliliters. Millimeters. Divided by two. Millimeters. Milliliters divided. No, by not no. liters, meters. Milli millimeters. Oh, yeah. Square divided by two. Oh. And that gives us when we do 54 divided by 2, what does that give us? Fifty four divided by two gives us what? Twenty seven. Twenty seven. Very good. Because we divide 
54 by 2, and then we get 27. Does that make sense? Yes, sir. Wynette, you understand that? Yes, sir. Good. Lincoln, explain how we got 27 meters squared. So, so the formula of the triangle is base times height divided by two. Mm -hmm. So what we did was was multiply nine millimeters times six millimeters, and nine times six give us fifty four millimeters squared. Then we divided that by two, mm -hmm. and then that's how we got twenty seven millimeters squared. Very good. Very good. Okay, then explain how we got. 27 millimeters squared. Good afternoon, Mr. Petit. Good afternoon. Go ahead, Kaden. Yes, you can divide 54 millimeters divided by two. Um, how do we get to 54? You divide nine millimeters times not times six millimeters so divided we by two. So we multiply nine times six, which gives 54, and we divide by two. Okay, good. All right, let's move on to the next question for this one. So the next question states that they want us to, they want us to, one, this is going to be one B, calculate the value of angle x. Calculate the value of angle x. Okay, so we have to figure out what angle x is. Okay, and notice that angle x is here. We have to figure out what this angle is. Now we know that this angle is how many degrees? Go ahead, Najara. Does this involve subtracting? Say it again. Does this involve subtracting? What are you going to subtract if you subtract it? There's two numbers. No, no. Yeah. We have um x. We're trying to figure out what is the size of angle x, this one. Are we going to add? Add what? All the numbers together. What all numbers? 12, 6, and 9. No. Oh, we, is it 33? We want to figure out the size of this angle, x. You say calculate the value of angle x, this one. Does anyone know how to do that? I don't. No? Trinity, uh, um, do you know? <laughs> calculate. Calculate how? What are we going to calculate? Are we going to divide anything? Um, uh, Kylie, do you know how to figure out the size of angle X? No, sir. No? Lincoln, do you know? Measure it. Say measure it. Um, no, sir. No, Madeline, do you know? Uh, for a second, I thought this was algebra. Do you know how we're going to figure out what X is? Not at all, sir. Not at all? Maya. I think I know. Go ahead, Lincoln. I think. No, never mind. I don't know. No. Maya, do you know? Najara, do you know? Um, do you have to, like, I think you add? Want... Go ahead, Maya. Do you have to add? Add what? Um, 12 plus 33. No, we ain't finding the perimeter. Oh. Um. Anyone else? You you add. Uh, Say it again, Najara. So we're trying to like find the trying number. To find, trying to find what x is. What was the value of x? So we'd also be trying to figure is out the, um, the angle in the corner. Is it seven? No, it's not seven. Wait. Do we add all the numbers, including thirty-three? So. Mm, no. So not if us to find out what angle X is. The angle in the corner. 
the first thing that we need to know is I'm going to tell you all a very important math secret because nobody know this is the first question that nobody know how to answer nobody know how to answer this so which you means want. that which means that I'm about to I'm about to reveal to y'all my secret so y'all gotta make sure that when I give you the secret you don't go telling all your friends at school right you have to keep the secret because this is how you get because this is how you get an A on the test right so here's the secret you ready? So the secret is that nobody told you yet is that angles inside a triangle add up to 180 degrees. That's the secret. This angles in a triangle add up all it this happens every time every time angles inside a triangle add up to 180 degrees excuse me mm -hmm. i said the, the angle in the corner no you want to you want to say the secret because you want to tell me that okay what's how, i didn't how mean the 180 though exactly i was talking about the angle so how are we going to get this we know that angles in the triangle add up to 180 degrees that's our secret nobody knew that until until now Right? So, okay, how are we gonna figure what angle X is? We know that angles inside a triangle add up to 180 degrees. So that means that angle X and this one right here and this one right here must all add up to 180 degrees. So X and this one and 33 must all add up to 180 degrees. So what, what, must, what must we do in order for us to, to answer this? The first thing I feel so smart now. <laughs> the first thing that we must do, you see this box, right? Yes. This, uh... this box actually means something. This box means that the angle here is 90 degrees. That's what this box means. See, I giving y'all all my secrets. Oh man, I giving y'all all my secrets. <laughs> Isn't that the right angle? <laughs> That's the right <laughs> angle, right? That's the right angle. Man. And y'all gonna be geniuses need to continue i need to continue okay 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 let me continue all right so this is 90 degrees this right here is 90 degrees okay so we have 90 degrees we have 33 and we have x and our goal is to make sure that all of them add up to 180 degrees so what must x be in order for us to make sure that the angles add up to 180 degrees and you all know how to get that if we know that 90 is 90, I was, I'm just saying that 90 plus 90 is 180. Okay. So why don't we add, right? So the first step we're going to do, we're going to add, we're going to add 90 and 33. Let's do that. Add I knew 90. we were adding something. <laughs> we're going to add 90 and 33. Add Wait, 90. Mr. Petit, uh -huh. in, in, a, in a different case, what would we add? Like, the two bottom numbers? You always add the two angles. They're always going to give you two angles. So you always add the two angles. So we add 90 and 33. What is 90 plus 33? 123. 123. 100, 123. 123 degrees. 23. Good. 123 degrees. And then, believe it or not, we are going to subtract. So we're going to subtract. Are we going to subtract 180? Yes, we're going to subtract 180 and 123. So we subtract um, 180 degrees. So 180 degrees. 180 degrees minus what? 123. 123. 123. 123 is what? Um, three, seven. Um, 70, 73. 57. Oh, 50, 57. 57. 57. 57. 57. 57. And so that means that. That, that what? X is what? 
So x is what? So let's put this. Let's put this. In, let's put this in a box. X is what? Fifty-seven degrees. Fifty-seven degrees. Fifty-seven degrees. Good. All right. Now y'all have the secrets to the game, so y'all should be able to get it right. So, quick recap: How do we do it? Well, the first thing that we have to acknowledge is that number one, angles inside a triangle add up to what? One hundred eighty degrees. One hundred eighty degrees. degrees. Right. That's the sir first secret. The next hey, thing, the next thing we know is that if we have a, a box like this, this always means 90 there's degrees. Not, it, there's always 90, degrees. 90 degrees. That's what this box means. This box means 90 degrees. And so what we do, we add 90 plus 33. And when we add 90 and 33, we get what? 123. 123 degrees. And then we take away 180 and 123 to get 57. Yes, yes, yes. Um, Kaden, your yeah, your mic is unmuted. Oh yeah, sorry, I forgot. So, what does that mean? That means 57 is the. That means that x is 57. So that means that let me put 57 right here. 57. Degrees. Uh, not so 57 is. And so that means that 57, 90, and 33 all adds up to what? If you if we add 57, 90, and, and 33, all of them should add up to what? 180. 100, 180. 180 degrees. Okay. So how did we get X? All we did was we added. 90 and 33. So we add 90 and 33. Then we get when we whatever whatever answer is we subtract it from 180. So we say 180 minus 123, and that gives us what? 57. 57 degrees. 57 degrees. All right. Um All right, do we understand this? I mean, if you understand this. Yes, no, so, not really. No? Not really. Not really. Not really. Yes, sir. Kind of. Kind of. Yes, sir. I understand it. Kind yes, sir. I'm um, so, I guess, go ahead. I don't, I wouldn't um, understand 1A. Oh, 1A, one, one all we do is multiply 9 times 6. We get 54. And then we divide that. And we divide it by two to get twenty-seven. Um, what I want y'all to do is take a picture of this I and understand. send to me. Take a picture of this and send to oh, me. What's up? For the first one, it's only. Oh, one. Just, I'm not, just not home. Take a picture of your work and send to me for your what's up again. Take a picture of this and send Excuse to me. Excuse me, Mr. Petit. My mommy on her phone. Okay. Once she finished, take a picture of your work. Excuse me, Mr. Petit. My mother's not home. Yes. When she comes, then you need to take the picture. Um. Go I'm, to me. Go ahead. So, yeah, take a picture of it then. So the Excuse me, Mr. Petit. Go ahead, Madeline. I accidentally skipped a page in my book. That's fine. That's no problem. Go ahead, Maya. So for the first one, all you have to do is multiply and divide. Yes, yes. Multiply nine times six and divide by two. All right. Yes, and then number part B, um, calculate the value of X. What we have to do, all we did was we add and then subtract. So the first one we add, sorry, the first one we multiply and divide. The second one we add and then subtract. It's kind of kind of simple. The first one we add and then Sorry, the first one we multiply and divide. The second one we add then subtract. Okay. So take a picture of your work and send it to me via WhatsApp again. Take a picture of your work and send it to me via WhatsApp. Say it again. Can you send this in the chat, please? Because I may not be able to finish it. Yes, okay, no problem. Okay. 
All right, so let's go ahead and Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and take a picture of this. Hey, Mr. Petit, um, my mother sent the year number on my brother's phone, so can I take a picture and see you inside? Yes, it? we can. You can. You can do that. Excuse me, Mr. Petit. Go ahead. I have to go now to track practice. Already? Okay, no problem. Bye. All right, take care. We are. Uh... There are drawings. All right, so let's go ahead and it's going to be what? Excuse me, Mr. Petit. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure this was the first one, but I can't open in the chat. Um, do you have your phone? Yes, sir. I'm gonna send it that way. Okay. Okay. And Laura, it's yes, sir, and no, sir. Not okay. You hear me, Laura? Yes, sir. Okay, good. Let's move on to this one. This is going to be great exercise. Um, Mr. Petit, did you get my work? Yes, I did, I did, I did, I did. Excuse me, Mr. Petit, I sent my work. Okay. Okay, let's do another example. Example number two. For this example, I want you to. Excuse me, Mr. Petit. Go ahead. Did you get my work? I did, I did, I did. Excuse me, Mr. Petit. Mm -hmm. You never told us what the shape was. Oh, it's called a right angle triangle. Oh. Yeah. It's called a right angle triangle. Okay, so let's uh, label this. So let's say that this is, and we know it's a right angle triangle because this right here. This box is right there. The box indicates 90 degrees. Let's say that this one is 24 degrees. All right. Let's say that this is X. So this is X. Okay. And then for our outside, so this is 13 millimeters. So that this is. Excuse me, Mr. Petit. Mm -hmm. Can I use the bathroom, please? Yes, quickly. Let's say that this is five. Millimeters. 
Okay. So the first thing we want to figure out is we want to determine Okay, I don't know why this thing is not allowing me to. One second. One second. I can't. I can't see all. I can see. I can see your um. Is it really? I can see your screen. You can yeah, see can my see screen? screen. Um, I don't know. I can't see all. Oh. So T should reset. I mean I could see y'all. The only way I could see all this. I mean I could see y'all now, but let me see something. I don't know. The thing is hiding. One second. You might leave and join back. Uh -huh. See, leave and join back. If I leave and join back. Where is this? I don't know where I put it. I I can't see y'all. I could see it. You can see it? I can't see yes, all for some reason. I don't know why is that the case. Okay, I can see y'all now. I can see y'all now. <clears throat> okay, so number what example two, two A. So we wanna find the area, find the area of the triangle. Um, so the area of a triangle is going to be area of triangle. Excuse me, Miss Pussy, I have a question. Go ahead. With the triangle, is there like, uh, are you actually like supposed to measure or like? Oh, they give you the numbers. Right? Yeah. So they... Oh, okay. Sorry. Yeah. yeah, you understand? In the exam, they give you the numbers. So you don't have to like figure out what the numbers are. So that's a good thing. In the exam, you would automatically be given the numbers. So. That's um. That's yes, the... sir. I can't see your screen, Mister Petit. I know I share now. Okay, good. So, so we know that um. What's the formula for the triangle? Um. Base. Base times. Height. Base times height, very good. Base times height. Base times height. Divided by two.
All right, so the base is going to be what? What's the base? The base is eight millimeters. So the base is um. The base is. The base is eight. The height is what? The height is five mil five millimeters. The height is five. The base is going to be what? Eight millimeters multiplied by the height, which is what? Five millimeters all over. Um, if no, 40. Uh, all over. All over 40. what? All over what's at the bottom? Excuse me, mm -hmm. two. All over two, yes. All over two. Excuse me, see. Go ahead. I already finished working that part out. What you got? What did you get? I got my whole answer and everything too. Okay. So we have eight times five, which is gonna be one what? eight millimeters squared. Okay, good. Eight times five, which is what? Forty. Forty. Excuse me. Go ahead. If it can um divide again, do we do can we divide twice? No, just divide once. Thank so you. So forty millimeters squared all over what? Two. Two. All over two. Forty millimeters squared all over two. And forty divided by two is what? Twenty. 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 It's gonna be equal to can I get some water, please? No problem. So 40 divided by 2. What is 40 divided by 2? We have to actually divide, right? Yes, sir. Excuse me, Mr. Butti. I have a quick question. Mm -hmm. How do you know when to stop? How do you know when to stop? Yeah, like stop on the... <laughs> stop the what? So like, like the base times height and then over two and then eight millimeters times five. Oh, once two. once you already divide 40 by two, then you stop. It's good for Mr. Petit. Okay. Two goes in the no, four. I, oh, Excuse me, Mr. Petit. Go ahead, um, Kylie. I already know what two divided, I mean, 40 divided by two means. What you got? Um, 20. 20, very good. 20 is the final answer. Excuse me, Mr. Petit. One second. What are you saying, Maya? I was saying, how do you know, like, how do you know, like, when to, like, stop doing the process? Well, the pro it's only two. It's only two steps. Multiply then divide. So once you already no, multiply, you know, like, base and height, like, when? How do you know when to stop? Because, like, I'm saying that. I might like go over, like go over. Go over what? Like do it more than two times. No, you don't have to. Once you once you multiply eight times five, you get forty. You do forty divided by two, and forty divided by two is twenty. It's gonna be twenty meters squared. That's it. All right. All right. All yes. right. Do we understand this? I mean, if y'all understand, I got 20 meters, millimeters squared. Yes, sir. I do. Yes, sir. Oh, Mr. Petit, I'm going to yes, send you a picture of my work. You can. You can. All right. Good. I don't understand. Do you understand? Um, uh, Trinity, you don't understand? No, Excuse me, Mr. One sec, one second. Trinity, what part don't you understand? 
Benefit. Okay, so what is the base, Trinity? Base. Base is eight. Good. What is, good. What is the height? At five mm. Good. What do we do with eight? What do we do with eight and five? Five. Sir. Good. So we say eight times five. So the first step is multiplication. You multiply eight and five. You understand that? You understand that? Yeah. Good. Then after we, we multiply eight times five, what do we get? 40. Good. So we have 40 divided by two. 40 divided by two. And so when we do 40 divided by two, what is that? What is 40 divided by two? 20. Say it again. 20. Good. You always divide by two. All right. So one second, Kylie. So so um so Trinity, you always divide by two. So in this case, we have 40 divided by two, but you always use two. All right. Trinity, you understand that? Excuse me. Trinity, do you Excuse understand me. that? Trinity, do you understand that? Where's Trinity? Yes, sir. Do you understand now? Okay, good. Let's move on to the next question. Excuse me, Mr. Mm -hmm. You're breaking up. Like I'm like breaking up. There's oh. like rocking noise. I was Excuse uh, me. Go ahead. Um, why do we always have to use two? That's just a formula. Oh. So part B. So two B. Excuse me, Mr. Petit. Go ahead. I already got my answer for two B. What you got? Sixty-six degrees. Sixty-six degrees. Okay. Calculate the value of angle X. Anyone else got the answer for two B? Yes, sir. What you got? 66 degrees. Okay. okay. So we know that this box means what? The box means what? 90 degrees. 90 degrees. All right, the box is 90. Um, and this is going to be... So we add... So it's going to be what, 90 degrees plus what? 24. Plus 20, 24. 24. Right? Plus 24. 90 plus 24 is what? 100, 100, 114. 114, very good. What are we gonna do with the one hundred and fourteen? What are you gonna do with that? Subtract it. You're gonna subtract it. Very good. Subtract it. So subtract. So we're gonna subtract. Um, 180 subtracted by 114. 180 degrees. Minus what? 114. 114 degrees. Um, so 180 minus 114. That would be... 74. No, no. 180 minus 114. Yeah, sure, when you subtract them. When you subtract them, what you get? 66. 66, very good. 66. And so what are we going to say? 
we're going to say that x is equal to what? 66. x is equal to 66. Why do you do like that? That like two C. Oh, like that. That S X. Oh, that's just a way, so it wouldn't look like a multiplication design. All right. All right. So, do we understand this? Let me know if you understand this, please, before we go on to the great exercise. Yes, yes, sir. we understand it. Excuse me, Mr. Petit. Yes, go ahead. Why is why is there like two C's right there? That's X. X is equal to sixty-six. Oh. Mm -hmm. All right. Take a picture of this and send it to me via WhatsApp. Take a picture of this and send it to me via WhatsApp, and then we can move on to the great exercise. Excuse me, Mr. Petit. Can I ask my mom if I can use that one? Yes, you can. Yes, you can. I already sent it. That's good. Again, take a picture of your work and send it to me via WhatsApp. Take a picture of your work and send it to me via WhatsApp. All right, let's go ahead and answer these questions. So for the great exercise, I'm just going to give you one. Excuse me, Mr. Petit. Uh-huh. I send my work. That's good. I start my work into Mr. Petit. That's good. Great exercise. Number two, number one, rather. You didn't have to read. I sent in my work. That's fine. I sent you my work, Mr. Petit. Okay. Excuse me, do we have enough? Wait, uh, are we bringing up questions? Yes. I think it'd be long. So, I'm only, only giving you all one. Um, so do this on your own. It's going to be a right angle. And let's say this one is. Twenty-eight degrees. So that's twenty-eight degrees. I say that this is x. It's x. Um. So this is 12 millimeters. So this is six millimeters. So this is five millimeters. All right, so the goal is very simple. We have the, the following, we have to Part A, this is number 1A, find, find the area, find the area of the triangle. And the next one is calculate the value of x.
okay um okay then what number you on i'm on eight i'm on one eight okay you understand what to do kind of kind of okay and kylie what number you on I am on 1A. 1A. Do you understand what to do? Yes, sir. Okay, and uh, Madeline, what number you on? I'm on 1A going to 1B. That's good. But do you understand what to do? Yes, sir. That's good. And um, Wynette, what number you on? 1A. 1A. Do you understand what to do? A bit. A bit? Okay. Um, I can't. This is between. One second. I as no way I don't wait. I one second. I cannot see y'all. I mean, I can see y'all now when it's not sharing, but when it's sharing, I can't see y'all. So I don't know why that's the case. Let me don't share. Let me share. Let's see if it changes anything. <laughs> Maybe we could like post it in the chat and then we could turn off the screen. Hey, let me see. I don't know. I, I don't know why. Like once I go on um show meeting windows. You can could just put it in the chat. Can you all can you all still see my screen? Yes. Yes. Yes, sir. Okay. Wynette, what number you on? Going on to 1B. You understand what to do for 1A? Yes, sir. Okay. And... Excuse me, Mr. Petit. Uh-huh. For 1A, for the graded exercise... I'm kind of confused because there's a remainder. There's a remainder? Yes, sir. You multiply. Um, What did you divide by? I divided by two. What is five times six? Thirty. I mean. Thirty. So how are you getting a remainder when you divide two by thirty? Excuse me, Say it again. I'm no. gonna try it again. Yeah, you 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 divide it wrong. Excuse me, Mr. Petit. Go I'm ahead. finished. I'm Take finished. A, no problem. Take a picture of your work and send it to me. Excuse me, Mr. Petit. Go ahead. Okay, is it okay if I write my work here on the other page? Yeah, that's fine. That's no problem. Thirty divided by two equals okay, fifteen. Okay, fifteen. I figured out the correct answer. Okay. Oh, I sent it, Mr. Bikini. You sent it? Okay.
Um, who who else is finished? Me, I'm finished. I'm, I'm finished. almost done with B. That's good. I'm done, Mr. Petit. Okay, that's good. Once you finish, take a picture of your work and send it to me via WhatsApp. Again, once you finish, take a picture of your work and send it to me via WhatsApp. Um, what a name is. Nachara? Excuse yes. me, Mr. Petit. Yes. May I plug in my laptop? Yes, you can. You can. Um, Lorenda, are you finished? Lorenda, are you finished? Mr. Petit, you were calling me earlier. Say that again? You were calling me earlier. No, I was calling Lorenda, Lorenda. Lorenda, where's Lorenda? Um, Lorenda, are you there? Where's Lorenda? Who else is finished with the first one? I'm done. Okay, if you finish with the first one, I put the second one inside the slide. I for this one, I want you to just, I want you to take a picture of. I I mean, for this one, I just want you to find the, the area of the triangle. Just find the area of the triangle. Okay. Do you want us to draw it? Yeah, draw it as well. Um, for those of you who are finished with the first two, um, Wynette, you finished with, with, the, with these two? Yes, sir. Take a picture of your work and send it to me. You ready to do that? Yes, sir. It's just my wife and I can slow again. Okay. Um, what I need you to do is do the work I have in the, on, in the chat with the two triangles. Yes, sir. Excuse me, Mr. Viti. Do you want us to write find the area of? Yes, you could do that. Yes, you could do that. Um, Kaden, what number you on? I'm on one B. I'm just tired. I don't. I I don't know what to do at this point. You don't know what to do. What you mean? You don't know what to do? I mean, I'm trying my best to figure it out. Well, for the first one, um, you have to multiply and divide. And for the second one, you have to add and subtract. Just look at the previous notes. You understand me? Yes, sir. Excuse me. Go ahead. In the chat, we're only finding the area, right? Yes, you're just finding the area. That's Thank all you're doing. Asia, you finish? Almost. Almost. Excuse me, Mr. Petit. Go ahead, Maya. Do you want us to draw it? Yes, you have to draw it. Excuse me, Mr. Petit. Uh huh. Can you send the picture again in the chat, please? Yes, I can. Madeline, what number you on? I'm on the one sent in the chat. Okay.
Um, for the ones inside a chart, you just find the area of it. So that means that you're gonna multiply the, the base time, the height. Wynette, what you get for the first one? For number one, for the first one? 15. You multiply 11 times 15, what you got? Wait. For number one, for the, for the, um, I mean, for the one, the one, the picture. You have to do base times height divided by two. For the first oh. picture. Let's get the rest of the tape. Excuse me. Okay. One, one second, one second. Go ahead, Bennett. What you got? 30. How did you get 30? I use very confusing number one. Number one? Is that what 11, 15, and 19? Um, on the first exercise, right? No, I mean the second one. I mean the second one. Oh, I haven't finished it. Say it again. I have not finished it. Okay. Um, <laughs> Um, can I move this? Um, this has collapsed on me completely, and yes. I'm falling. Excuse yes, me. Yes, you need to move it. Yes. Excuse me. Yes, go ahead. Um, when you're dividing and you can't go into that number no more, you add a point to give it a zero, right? Yes, you do. You do that. Okay, mm -hmm. I, I did that. That's good. I'm I'm finished, Mr. Petit. That's good. Go ahead. You did you did all two? Yes, sir. Good. Go ahead, Maya. I don't understand the label in the chat. Um eleven is for eleven meters is for eleven millimeters is for the is for the side on the right hand corner. The fifteen is for the one at the bottom and the nineteen is for one on the other side. Isn't oh never mind. See it? I thought we were doing two A because no, we just just we just find in the area. Um, Kaden, Kaden, please up a seat. Yes, sir, I'm just trying to fix it. it. Just keeps falling. This is the rest of the tape. Go ahead. I am the second. I am the um, first on the chat. Yes. That's good. Okay, let's go ahead and, and answer this question. I'm gonna see. One second. Let's go ahead and answer this. So let me let me answer. Let's go ahead and answer this. So the first one, let me see if you got it right. Um so for this one, we have um what y'all have for number one eight for the first one? It's gonna be what? I um I have, um, I have, um, I have, um, I have, base, I have base times, height. base times, base times, divided by what? Two. Divided by two. What is the base? The base is, the base is going to be six millimeters. Yes, and the height is? Five millimeters. Five millimeters. Five millimeters. Divided by what? Two. Divided two. by two. It's going to yeah. be equal to five. Six times five is what? Thirty. Four. Thirty. Thirty. Thirty millimeters. Square. Square. What are we going to do yeah. with that? We're going to divide it by what? Two. two. Thirty divided by two is what? Uh, Fifteen. Fifteen. Did anyone get 15 millimeters inside the chart? Millimeter squared? Let me know, please. I, got I, got it. I get it. Anyone? I get it. I get it. Um, if you got that I right, did. if you got that right, let me put I inside the chart so I could know that you got it. If you got the first one right, put I inside the chart. Najara, yeah. Wynette, um, Asia, Lorenda, Kylie, yeah. Madeline. If you got the first one right, please put I. Alora. Okay. Tajani. Um, well, I did not see Trinity. Did you get the first one right? Trinity. 
Trinity, Trinity, yes. Trinity, did you get the first one right? Trinity, did you get the first one right? Best Trinity. Sorry? Um, did you get the first one right? Mr. Petit. One second, legacy. Um, go ahead, Trinity. Did you get the first one right? Yes, okay, I said put an I inside the chat, Trinity, if you got the first one right. That's what I said. Um now for the second one, what do I get for the second one? For part B. So we add. First thing we do is we add. So it's going to be what? 90 plus 28. This, is this 90? 90, 90 plus 28. 90 plus 28. Very good. So it's going to be 90 degrees plus what? 28. Plus 28 degrees. And that's going to be equal to what? 118. 90 plus 28 is going to be what? 118. 118. And then we subtract. 180 subtracted by 118. We subtract. And one hundred and eighty minus one hundred and eighteen. One hundred and eighty minus one hundred and eighteen. One hundred and eighty minus one hundred and eighteen. It's gonna be what? Sixty-two. 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 I got that right. Anyone got 62 right? Anyone got x is equal to 62? I did. Yes. I did. I did. Put an I inside the chart if you got that right, please. Number two, put an I inside the chart if you got that. Okay, good. Excuse me, Mr. Petit. Yes. Okay. When the first one sent in the chat, I got a remainder. Um, Remember, we don't do remainders. You have to put... um. 0.5. Anyone got all right for this? Anyone got all right? Let me know if you got all right. I did. I did. I did. I did. Okay. All right. Inside the chat, put Y if you got all right. Put Y if you got all right. Y. Legacy. Kaden. Um, Madeline. Maya. Wynette. Kylie. Um, Trinity, did you get all right? Where's Trinity. Oh, so I will have some things number. Sit again. No, I mean for the second one, this one, number this part B. Did you get to get this right? 62. Sit again. Oh, you didn't get the completed. All right. Okay, so next, let's do this one. So we have. Um, We have Excuse me, your screen is blah. We have yes, you can, can you send the second picture in the chat, please? Uh one second. We have eleven meters. At, at the bottom we have what? What what is what is it? Fifteen? Fifteen. Fifteen. Fifteen millimeters, and then what we have on the side? Nineteen. Nineteen, very good. Now, how are we gonna find the area of this triangle? What are we gonna do? So the area is gonna be equal to what? The base multiplied by what? Multiplied by the height divided by what? divided by two, so A is gonna be equal to, base is what? The base is what, 15 millimeters times, 
11 all over 2 so the area is going to be equal to 15 times 11 what is 15 times 11 15 times 11 is 165 millimeters squared. Yes, 165 millimeters squared. All over two. And we have two into 165. We have to divide it. So how many times does two go into sixteen? Eight times. How many times does two go into sixteen? Eight times. Eight times. So two times eight is going to be what? Sixteen. 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 A minus sixteen and sixteen, which gives us what? Zero. 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 Bring down the five. Zero. And we, what do you have to do with the five? Bring it down to zero. zero. Bring down to five. Very in my good. class, we don't add two zeros. In my class, we don't add two zeros. Just one. And so, how I many times does two go into five? Twice. 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 Make sure you hurry up. I'm starting. You hear what Maya? Um. So, how I many times does... So, we have two times two, which gives us what? Four. So we have five minus four, four which is what? One. One. Uh, Maya, what do we do at this point? You have to you have to put a point five. You have to put a point. What is the point? What does the point allow us to do? Uh, add a zero. Add a yeah. zero. Very good. And how many times does two go into ten? Five times. Five times. Two times five is what? Ten. Ten. And ten minus ten is what? Zero. Zero. So eighty-five point two is the correct answer. Eight point five. And so the area of this triangle is going to be um eighty-five, eighty-two rather. Eighty-two. Point five millimeters squared. All right. Hey, Sibiti, which question is this? Is this the first one? The first one in the chat. Okay. Did anyone get this? 82.5? I did not get that. Actually, I got that. I got that. I got that. I got oh. that. You saw what I sent you. I, I did. That's good. That's good. Um, what y'all got for the second one? I didn't get to do it yet. Yeah. Got to I got the picture. So I didn't see the picture. Okay. Okay. Um, anyone got this first one? I don't see the picture. Anyone got this first one, right? I mean, this one. Whatever. Yeah. That's good. I did, I did not. Okay. Um, we have to leave. So what I wanted to do is. Take a picture of your work and send it to me via WhatsApp, and then I'll see you all on tomorrow. Have a wonderful evening. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye. Bye, Mr. Bye, bye, bye. bye, Matisse. All right, take care. Bye. Have a good evening. Have a good evening. Bye-bye, Mr. Petit. Have a good evening, Madeline. Okay. Our drawings.